I'm Vincent, so I'm CEO uh, at Opstext. I'm in charge of uh, the organization and what's happening in the, at the Ops Battery. So Opstext started in 2012. We started as investigators of the, of the university and we had a telescope in Las Campanas. And the idea was to make an alternative to amateur astronomers and professionals for having a site for robotic telescope. The Observatorial South started at very little, uh, a single building at the beginning with only two amateur astronomers, uh, two small telescopes. And uh, now it grew up to 37 telescopes actually running on site, uh, 40 by next month. And we are building a, a new building for 11 telescopes, which is almost full. And they will start another building for 11 more telescopes. Uh, the idea of Obstec for the next few years is really push on uh, on one side, on amateur astronomers for having the best service for amateur astronomers and astrophotography and collaborative science. And this real high-end alternative will give the best service for amateur astronomers. I'm Samuel Robert. I am the CDO of Obstec, mostly concerned about the development of new technologies on the observatory and also I take care about the, the systems that make possible this observatory to work remotely. The main aspects of this observatory are a very high bandwidth of internet. We have three independent connections. One is a 100 megabyte symmetric fiber link, which is the same one that is going to fit the new LSST project in Sarrobachon. Also, we have a second radar link, which is about 70 megabyte symmetric bandwidth. The observatory is powered by a solar plant, so we have more than 20 kilowatts in solar panels generation. This is a world-class observatory. In terms of clear nights a year, we have, in average, more than 300 clear nights. Last year, 2018, we had 320 clear nights a year. The average thing is uh, around one arc second, mostly below it, depending on the season of the year. And we have a normally low humidity, and there's no much wind during the night, so it's a very good site for a telescope to up uh, one meter. Hi, I'm Jonathan. I live on the site. On I'm here to keep an eye on your setup, to collimate, to installing or cleaning your equipment, to be sure all is fine. Hi, I'm Rodrigo. Uh, I am an automation engineer. I take care of uh, hardware development uh, of the observatory. I work in Santiago, but periodically uh, I go to the observatory to perform the upgrades and maintenance in the observatory system. This is my job. Hi, I'm Abner. Uh, I'm uh, finishing my PhD in astronomical instrumentation and recently joined to the uh, test team as a uh, manager operation to oversee all uh, the support and administration. I'm in charge of managing the, the people that work with us. That includes uh, technician support and the guards. The observatory is not only growing in terms of uh, number of telescopes and buildings, but we are also growing in terms of activity. We are doing a new workshop, new dorms for the people working on site. And here behind me, we are building a new house, uh, mostly for amateur astronomers who want to come here to stay on site, either to install their equipment or just for stargazing and uh, having a, a large Dobson and telescope to take the best advantage and the best sites in the world for, for stargazing and uh, and real uh, visual observations. Mm -hmm.